Hello beauties, welcome back to another little vlog. Oh girl, don't you be snatching my ponytail. <laughs> Can you believe it though? Birdie Blue, BB, my little birdie is six months old today. How do you feel about that? <laughs> same hun, same. <laughs> oh, I'm emotional, I feel just like, you know when you just like feel stressed but you realise it's actually because you're just quite emotional. So yeah, I felt a little bit on edge. Um, we're about to get some cute pics and see how they turn out, upload them to Instagram. But yeah, I can't believe it. My little darling is six months old. She has two teeth and <laughs> the sleeping regression is real. Your little outfit is cute though. This is from Child's Play. A little Versace number. Can't lie, it was gifted. So thank you so much, Child's Play. A little snazzy one for her six month photo shoot. Girl, I'm not about to be flashing everyone. <laughs> my nipples that you have bitten to death how crazy is that I mean I say that she's just bitten them once or twice and it hurt like you know they're still intact thank goodness otherwise no more milk for you missus <laughs> she's been a little bit grumpy though because her teeth are really bothering her anyway so we're about to take some pictures and then my goodness we have some sorting out to do oh my goodness okay. six months today where has the time gone? We're trying to get a photo, guys. <laughs> but it's not been very successful. <laughs> I'll update you later. That didn't go too badly. You were a good little girl for that. Very good. Oh my goodness, but look at this mess. Wowzers, we have to get through this this week, guys, which is gonna be very satisfying and very challenging. My bestie Rax has helped me basically put this into piles and it's gonna go in the drawers over there. We're just gonna sort this whole room out this week, to be honest. It's just a hot mess right now and there's nothing more satisfying than like a clearing out vlog or an organizational video. Don't know about you, but I like them. So hopefully you're gonna enjoy, um, yeah, getting organized this week with me and we have a few little things planned as well. She's also learned um, where my hair is now and wants to pull it all the time, so that's fun. Yay! Okay guys, so I have to tackle these drawers and what's in them before I can actually put stuff back into them because they're packed already. So I'm just literally going through and I have like a bag full of used makeup and then a bag full of like brand new makeup, like for stuff that is quite literally unopened. Oh my gosh, um, also disclaimer, this isn't a, oh my gosh, look how much stuff I've got video. Of course, this is my job. I get sent um, products to review, so you guys know what to spend your money on and what's good and what isn't. So I do have to say that. I mean, I shouldn't have to say that, but there's always the odd comment here and there. So yeah, we're tackling these drawers. Wowzers. So yeah, I'll let you know how I get on with that. <laughs> What's she up to? I don't know. I feel like she's getting... What are you up to? <laughs> Do you like that vibrating toothbrush? Ooh. Her face! <laughs> Does that feel funny? Your first little toothbrush. This is really cute actually guys. It's like a little baby toothbrush. I think it's by... Yeah, it's by Foreo. So thank you so much for sending that. It's a baby toothbrush. Oh, this is never ending, never ending. I'm gonna call it a day. Give Bibi a bath, Buzzy's just run it. So let's check on her. Six months old, can you believe it? Oh dear. Do you wanna play a little toy? Yeah, <laughs> rubber ducky. I think it's bath and bedtime for you now, my little darling. You're so cheeky. Straight in the mouth. Bath and bed and we'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Good morning. So today I have a lot of organizing to do. <laughs> a lot and some filming. Um, I can hear BB downstairs has just been put in a high chair to have her breakfast. So let's go down and have breakfast. And I just wanted to say before I go down actually, um, thank you so much to everyone that's commented on uh, my last vlog about my hair loss. <sighs> yeah. It's not the end of the world, of course I know that, and um, there's been a mixture of positive and negative comments, but mostly it's just you guys building me up and kind of reassuring me that I'm not alone, and I'm glad that I've reassured others that it's normal and you're not alone either, but my thoughts are if 
I can help it a little bit and um, kind of try some products that work and just prevent it as much as possible, then why not? Why not? Anyway, let's go down, guys. What's on the menu this morning? <gasps> You're so lucky. I eat a whole one of these there. Oh my goodness. Oh, she is desperate for that. <gasps> Yummy! You're such a big girl, six months old! Six months old! Oh, you're so sweet! Oh, it's been a long day. I've been filming back to back to back. And I'm obsessed with these products on my face. These are, all the products on my face are basically by a brand called Laruc, which is an incredible brand that I've discovered. It's like a proper artistry brand. And I'm actually doing a masterclass with them tomorrow, online on Zoom, so I'm excited about that, but yeah. So if you want to know what products I'm wearing, by now my reel will be live um, with all of the breakdown for the names of what I've got on my face. But now we're going for a walk. It's raining, but you know, we might stop off at the pub. I'm gonna try and resist, but you know me, I like a pub stop. I just love the pub. I love the pub, I love a beer, I love pub grub, I love pub life, I love pub, 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 pub. <laughs> Are you ready to go on your walk, my little darling? <laughs> Just get in the pram. She's gonna have to sit up soon in one of these, like turn it in from a cop to it. like a... Have something you have, so I'll bring it. Okay, so I don't know if this was a good idea or not. Yeah. <laughs> it's pouring with rain. Oh, look at the rain clouds. It's like a friggin' hurricane going on over there, I'm sure. It actually does look like a little bit of a tornado. Look tornado? How, look how cosy she looks in there though. Oh, so cosy! Hey. So cosy. Hopefully she's not getting wet. Oh, this is the wrong day to come out on a walk with a face full of makeup. And a good face full of makeup as well. Well, this backfired. All we've been wanting to do all week is go on a walk. And this is what happens. And the cows film me. <laughs> Look at the little baby car! Okay, oh, mm. it's stuck. Oh, it's stuck in. Scared. If only there's somewhere on this walk we could take a break and get out the rain. <laughs> somewhere around the corner. Come on, let's go. <laughs> well, we're seeking refuge. There's no space indoors. Only space out here, but it's quite cosy, isn't it? Cheers. <laughs> So good, it's so rainy. <laughs> Morning guys, so the pub was a semi-success. We walked home and it wasn't raining, so that was a good little pit stop. Um, so today we've got another day of organising. I've also got a little masterclass later with a new brand called Laruc. This situation, I've got Rax helping me out in the corner over there. <laughs> and baby girl is having a nap. So yeah, more organisations. We've categorised things, we've got skincare boxes. We've got brushes and highlights in that bag, lip products, lip products, miscellaneous, a mess. <laughs> we also have a bag of um, donations. Most of my clothes go to e-bloggers, not so much products, but um, yeah, we've got a lot going on in here, guys. I can't wait to show you it like a little bit more tidy by the end of the week. I mean, are we gonna achieve it? Who knows? Who knows? I get ready, do something with my hair. Wow, that regrowth though. Amazing. I'll get my hair done very soon actually. Daniel Galvin, very excited for that. I think I'm partnering with L'Oreal on like a hair dye thing. Can't wait. Just ignore the mess by the way. <sighs> Need to sort my life out. Right, see you when I am a little bit more presentable. Oh, okay. Nearly ready, got the event in about 10 minutes. Little missus is just having a little bounce, look. Those little pom-pom socks, it's so cute. Oh, <laughs> you're so excited. Give everyone a big smile. Oh, look. I just love this little baby so much. These are some of the products I'm gonna be using. Got my laptop set up, got my mirror. <laughs> and luckily people just see the background, like no mess. None of this mess. And then later, Mummy's going out for dinner. Yes, I'm actually going out for dinner with some friends tonight. 
Um, it's been a while since I have been out for dinner in a restaurant and now we're allowed inside so I'm going to meet up with some friends to celebrate the reopening of restaurants and just to have just some nice food and drinks really. Buzzy's gonna be on um, daddy duty this evening, drop me at the station and I mean I'll only be gone a few hours but I'm excited to see my friends have some dinner and drinks and then I'll cuddle home when I get home. Hi Carol Shaw, celebrity makeup artist um, who received a makeover at age 17 that really changed her life. So the the masterclass went well guys, this is the look. The same one that I created for the reels. The products! Can't bang on about them more. At least my makeup's done now, ready to get dressed, go out, look. I've got an anxiety rash, I go all red and blotchy when I'm nervous or like anxious or when I'm talking on the phone because your girl hates talking on the phone. I've got like this weird phone anxiety. I know it's not just me, <laughs> I thought it was pretty much all my life until I saw lots of videos on TikTok joking about it and I was like, that's me. <laughs> I literally can't even ring the hairdressers or the takeaway like place to submit a food order like what is wrong with me but i can talk to millions of people on youtube and like one and a half million people have watched me give birth what <laughs> doesn't make sense anyway i'm about to get dressed go out i'm excited to eat and drink and get merry don't know what i'm wearing yet um sorry this vlog's a bit random not really sure where it's going but hey spend a week with us is a little bit chaotic as per usual and let's get ready and she's ready to go to london buzzy's cracked a beer it's been in the freezer for like half a year. Um, what do you think of my outfit, guys? I've not worn heels in so long. Right, she's got her little niece. Woohoo! Daddy, I'm going to see you in the middle of the night. <laughs> because when I get back, which will be like, it's evening now, so it'll probably be like midnight, she'll be up at four because she goes to bed in a couple of hours and then wakes up around four. Probably will wake up around one knowing my luck as soon as I get in. And um, yeah, can't wait to cut it when I get in. But anyway, I'll let go. <laughs> Morning guys, so last night was a success, but I actually enjoyed myself. I missed Birdie. We're about to go on a walk, so she's just being put in the pram at the moment with Buzzy. But yeah, it was a really lovely evening. I missed her, but she was good as gold. I got back and she didn't wake up until like 6 a.m. So I feel like she was on her best behavior because she knew that Mummy wanted a little night out. <laughs> the sun's shining, we're about to go on a walk. What we like? And I must tackle the beauty room because we started it and when you start something like oh to be this little baby all cozy in there oh it's such a gorgeous day like better than the rain the other day that was literally the worst thing ever i know i've got an unnecessary puffer jacket on feeling very hot so i might take it off in a minute <sighs> decided to get her out of the buggy this is a first on our walk but normally it's like too cold and she needs to be wrapped up all warm but the sun's out you're looking at the cows, aren't you? Cheeky. <laughs> oh, looking at the cows. Do you love the cows? <laughs> and there's some cute little baby ones there. I'm obsessed. She love it. Do you love it? <laughs> oh. Lovely little pit stop, steak lunch. Do you like steak? I'm actually not gonna let her eat meat until she's older because I wish I could be a vegetarian. I was for two years, but that's another story. Um, so yeah, I eat meat again now, but I won't let her until she's old enough to um, ask for it, I don't think. I don't know, what are your thoughts on that? Anyway, I'm gonna have my lunch and enjoy. Good morning, oh, I literally had a food coma after the pub and we just chilled. I watched Kardashians <laughs> and um, Bibi went to bed nice and early. She was so good last night, but today Buzzy's just it's too early for kids' toys. <laughs> Buzzy's just at the new house and I'm trying to tackle this because as I said, we've got to do this. We've got to do it, guys. How are you feeling today, BB? It's a mess, isn't it? Mommy's got to clear all this up. I need to feed her breakfast, actually. Oh, the reason why, by the way, I don't think I really explained myself when I said about the vegetarian thing. Um, 
Don't get me wrong, I know that if I wanted to be a vegetarian I could just stop eating meat. It's just a relapse at the moment. The reason why I turned vegetarian a few years ago, and it lasted for a couple of years, was mainly because of how I felt towards animals, to be quite honest with you. Along with the everything to do with health and everything and watching documentaries on Netflix, I just feel like it's unnecessary for me to feed her meat whilst she's so young until she can actually ask for it. I don't think there's anything wrong in that. And I'm also gonna work on reducing my meat intake. I just feel like with everything going on in the world and the meat industry is not a pleasant one, let's be honest. So yeah, that's just my personal thoughts on that. But again, you know, if you're not vegetarian, you do you, if you are, you do you. But that's what I meant by I wish I could be because let's be honest, if I wish I could be, I could just be. I guess I lost the passion that I really had for not eating meat initially. Um, so hopefully I'll get that back, but I definitely don't want to introduce anything to her until she's a bit older. Also, I feel like I totally didn't dissect the night when I went out with my friends on Thursday and I absolutely got up on stage, which you saw a little clip of, and <laughs> literally entertained the whole place all night long, like you saw one clip, but I sung so many songs on stage, like what is life? Obviously after a few cocktails, they were like, get up and sing Cece, and I was like, no, and then I was like, oh, go on then, then you couldn't take the mic off me, so yeah, that was, that was that, it was so much fun, we were doing salsa dancing in our own little like area, um, it just felt like normality. I just can't wait for the whole world to be open up, opened up again so we can do things like that in other countries. I mean, are you going to be travelling? What's your thoughts on travel this summer? Because I'm, like, desperate to get away. But I'm just grateful that I, could, I can now go out to dinner and, um, yeah, experience things like that that makes me feel like normality is returning. This little baby, honestly. What did I do to get so lucky, guys? Right, let's clear this up. What are you doing, little girl? Why is it that you have all these toys in front of you and you want my jacket? <laughs> We're getting there, guys. The floor is looking cleaner. This, just made this all pretty and neat. Um, now I've got Buzzy helping me. <laughs> By the way, I'm going to have so much stuff to give away, so stay tuned for the end of the video because I'm going to be giving boxes of makeup away. So. That's exciting. Ooh, yes. Just feeding whilst Buzzy hoovers. And look at this. This was empty when Buzzy brought this hoover up the stairs. Like, that is how much fluff and dust was lurking in this room on the floor. Like, how crazy is that? That is satisfying though, isn't it? Still got all these clothes to sort out and um, yeah. Guys, we did it. We did it, this room. I mean, are you joking? Are you joking? So much room for activities! <laughs> I'm so pleased and I'm so grateful for the help of my BFF Racks and Buzzy as well because I couldn't have done it without them, let's be honest. So let me give you a little tour. This isn't like a beauty room tour because I actually have one of those on YouTube already and pretty much everything is the same as um, like organised in the same manner. But I've just had to like get rid of so much stuff. There's so much stuff I'm giving away. Of course, I just said that I'm doing a giveaway. So I'll show you my bundles and how you can enter to win. So many bags going to the charity shops as well. I've made some bundles for family and friends. So yeah, I'm really pleased. I feel very cleansed. Let me give you a tour. Also, BB's sleeping downstairs like a little angel. But yeah, look, I can actually walk into my walk-in wardrobe now. <laughs> of course, she's organized my palettes and liners. And then we have, yeah, we've got like lots going on here and extra space as well. Again, eyeshadows. I think this is like blush and bronzers and highlights. Yes. You know, it's functional. It might not be like the most aesthetically pleasing thing ever. However, this is... Uh, you can't lie, that is pleasing. So that's very satisfying. Now I can sit here, it's all clear. I can do my makeup, eat my oats. That's a basket full of PR that I still need to unbox, but it's just come in over the last day. So um, I've just focused on what was here, if you remember. I'm just obsessed with the space. It was crazy. So yeah, this is my stuff that I'm giving away initially for this YouTube video. So I'm gonna do a few giveaways this week. One specifically for YouTube, um, one on TikTok, and then one on Instagram as well. I'm gonna try and get the TikTok one up over the next couple of days, but the YouTube one is gonna be this bundle of makeup in here. 
let me show you. I apologize for not laying it out all beautifully, but you know, time is of the essence right now. So to enter to win this bundle, I mean, we have Laura Mercier, Dose of Colors, Revolution, Garnier Skincare. We've got key sunglasses, some gorgeous tanning products, and yeah, even Madison Beer's new album. <laughs> Just a gorgeous bundle of makeup. Also, you've got the Makeup Showstoppers by KVD Beauty. Such a gorgeous array of products. So to enter, to win this, all you really need to do is follow me on Instagram and YouTube, like this video and leave a comment below. Uh, make sure you hashtag giveaway in your comment. Leave like a little positive comment of something you've enjoyed over this past week. And yeah, hashtag giveaway. And I'll be announcing the winner in my next upload which will be over the next week. I don't know if it's gonna be on Wednesday or Sunday or, to be honest, you need to turn the notifications on. So that's really important um, so that you know if you've won or not. And I'll announce the name in the description of my next video. Again, I'll leave the instructions down below for you to enter. TikTok will be pretty similar, but it'll be a separate bundle of makeup for my TikTok followers. And then you just have to follow me on Instagram and TikTok and comment on that. Just make sure if you want to obviously stay in the loop that you turn my post notifications on, on all the platforms, especially Instagram and YouTube. Thank you guys, that means the world to me. I love you so much. And without you guys, I wouldn't even have this because this is my job to tell you what um, is good out of all of these products. So I am very fortunate, but at the same time, I love to give back. So best believe there'll be plenty of giveaways coming. And spoiler alert, I've actually bought a Gucci giveaway, a Gucci bag to give away as well. Have been meaning to do like a little ASMR unboxing. So that's also coming too. So hopefully there'll be lots of people winning things because it's always a shame. I always feel like I want to give back to everyone. So I'm going to do lots of bundle giveaways rather than just one humongous one. So there's lots of uh, opportunities to win for different people. Now I've just made a mess of my floor again. What am I like? This has been a fun, productive week though. I mean, yeah, this, this room is definitely making me feel like cleansed and just, I. I can think straight now, do you know what I mean? So thank you for spending this week with us. Let's go and see whether Birdie's awake or not and then we'll say goodbye to you together. You're awake! Say bye bye everybody! Oh, I love it when she's just woken up, she's always so cuddly. Um, we're actually off to our brother-in-law's today. It's their 10 year wedding anniversary, little surprise for them. So we're excited to see some family in Ipswich, aren't we? Yay, yay, yay! <laughs> So thank you again for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Good luck with the giveaway. We love you lots. Mwah. Bye! <laughs>